Oh, no. Yeah! The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Come on, negotiations have broken down and we now have a war on our hands. Yeah, they couldn't wait to get a hold of each other. He slips out. Wow, looked to me like he had it locked in pretty good. I guess not. This kind of offense he's known for. That's it. It's over. It's over. The offensive front Lesnar is working well right now. Wow, he just slammed him with ease. But he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound. Yeah, but if you count him out now, guys, you'd be making a very big mistake. Mark my words. Singles action is underway, and in this one, I wouldn't attempt to predict what's going to happen. I'd just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. The only thing that would make this match more enjoyable to watch would be if I was calling it without you two bozos interrupting me. Brock Lesnar still enters every match as the odds-on favorite. Yeah, I would never predict a Lesnar loss, Saxton, because you can enter Suplex City, but you will never come out the same. Watch out! Here we go with Matt Hardy. Keep your eye on this one. Look at this. Oh, oh boy, man. he is rolling. Into the quick cover. And the speedy kick out by Brock Lesnar. Too soon. He's docking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Look out! He's looking good now, guys. Brock Lesnar is in a real bad spot here. The great ones always explode when they have the chance. Seems to me, guys, like we're just moments away from seeing the using all his power to drive him to the mat. I'm not sure how much he has left. Let me tell you, the human body was not meant to be slammed like that. Brock Lesnar with a nice reversal. Watch Brock Lesnar put it together here. Oh, boy. And five. Oh, my. I think this is the beginning of the end, Michael. But now, can Lesnar make the most? The finisher could absolutely end this match, Michael, as you were saying. But it's not a guarantee. Sometimes it takes two or even three to get the job done, and even then, it's not a sure bet. A la Randy Savage versus The Ultimate Warrior at WrestleMania 7. That's my favorite match of all time. Randy Savage landed an amazing five top rope elbow drop, but was still unable to put work. Matt Hardy's looking to end it. Looking for one move after the other. It's devastating. Now he's got a cap. He's got him covered. He hasn't done nearly enough to get the pin yet. <laughs> yeah, try again. There is no way that is going to topple the Beast Incarnate. I got to agree with you, Corey, on that one. He slams him down with authority. Anytime a superstar sees an opening for their finisher, they got to take it, as Byron was saying. Elongating the match not only gives your opponent an opportunity to get back in it, but you're also running the risk of injury anytime you're in the ring longer. Than Will he be victorious? Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. He's got some fight left in him. It'll take a lot more than that to keep him down. He drops.
drops the leg. You can see the wear and tear that this fight has taken out of these men. A lot of damage taken on by Lesnar. I'm not sure how this is going to pan out. Don't count the beast out yet. There may be no coming back from this. just too fast for him. Lightning speed from the Beast. That's a great offensive display from Matt Hardy. Brock Lesnar just too fast for him. Lightning speed from the Beast. With an F5! Bang! Lesnar back in firm control of this match. There's the pin. It's over. It's all over. These guys were awesome. Let's take another look. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise, but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great matches in recent WWE history. Count yourselves lucky, people. You might watch WWE for years and only see a match Here that good winner, a few times. Yeah. Epic.